It's the skin you're in that matters. You are consciously aware of being a black person in America. Your system responds to that. I was not surprised that the pandemic had the disparate effects that it did on African Americans. I am the originator of John Henryism theory, which posits that repeated higher for coping over years, over decades, with very difficult life circumstances can really cause damage to the cardiovascular system and then eventually lead to high blood pressure, heart attacks, and strokes. The John Henryism theory takes its name from the legend of John Henry, the steel driving man. Some said he was born in Texas, some said he was born in Maine, but I don't give a damn where that poor boy was born. He was a steel driving man. Lord, now he was a steel driving man. John Henry engaged in an epic battle against a newly invented steam drill, and he beat the machine. But he dropped dead after his victory from complete mental and physical exhaustion. You have today, in 21st century America, so many African Americans who are caught up in a John Henderson situation, who are faced with real adversity, deepening economic hardship, loss of jobs, loss of health insurance, threats to one's sense of personhood, one's sense of dignity. The stress is enormous, and people, people don't give up. That persistence, working twice as hard, over time can really impair multiple physiological systems. By the time they're in their 20s and 30s and 40s, they're already having things like high blood pressure, diabetes, obesity. Now along comes the pandemic and they are susceptible because of these underlying conditions and yet they have to try to make a living. That's the John Henderson situation. It's on display. <laughs>